Richard Charles Hoagland, a name that echoes through the corridors of conspiracy and fringe science. But who is the man behind the theories that have captivated and disturbed so many? Born on April 25, 1945, Hoagland's journey into the realm of the bizarre began innocuously enough. But as we peel back the layers of his claims, we uncover a web of deception and delusion that stretches across the solar system. Hoagland's obsession with the face on Mars became his calling card. He claimed this geological formation was evidence of an ancient alien civilization, hidden from the public by a sinister NASA cover-up. But Hoagland's theories continued beyond Mars. He saw conspiracies everywhere on the moon, on Earth, even in the depths of Jupiter. Hoagland claimed to have discovered evidence of massive, ten-mile-high buildings, he said, are proof of an alien presence we were never meant to see. Hoagland's claims became more outlandish, and so did his methods. He proposed a new form of physics called hyperdimensional physics, which the scientific community rejected as baseless pseudoscience. Hyperdimensional physics is a concept popularized by Hoagland, who claims it represents a more complete understanding of the universe by extending traditional physics into higher dimensions. Hoagland suggests that this form of physics builds on the original ideas of James Clerk Maxwell, particularly his quaternion equations, which were later simplified by Oliver Heaviside into the more commonly taught Maxwell's equations. Hoagland's version of hyperdimensional physics posits that our three-dimensional reality is just a subset of a series of higher dimensions that influence everything from matter's physical properties to nature's fundamental forces. He claims these dimensions can affect our reality through information and energy gating, suggesting that unseen hyperspatial realities are the foundational substrate maintaining our perceived universe. Hyperdimensional physics, as proposed by Richard Hoagland, is a controversial and largely discredited theory within the scientific community. It attempts to explain physical phenomena through the existence of higher dimensions, but lacks substantial empirical evidence to support its claims. But perhaps most disturbing is Hoagland's pattern of deception. He has repeatedly claimed credit for others' work, including the design of the Pioneer Plaque, a claim vehemently denied by Carl Sagan and others involved in its creation. As we delve deeper into Hoagland's world, the line between reality and fantasy blurs. His theories tap into our deepest fears and insecurities about our place in the universe. Hoagland's ideas prey on our morbid curiosity, our desire to believe in something beyond our understanding. They force us to confront the possibility that everything we know might be a lie. But what if Hoagland is right? What if we are surrounded by evidence of alien life, hidden in plain sight? What if the very foundations of our reality are built on a cosmic deception? Or what if the real horror is not what Hoagland claims to have discovered, but the depths of delusion the human mind can reach when it becomes untethered from reason? Richard Hoagland a name that will forever be associated with the darkest corners of human imagination, where fear and fascination intertwine. In the end, his legacy serves as a chilling reminder of how easily our minds can be turned against us, transforming the wonders of the cosmos into a landscape of paranoia and dread. Thank you for joining me on yet another episode of That's Disturbing. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos like this.